Good evening, brothers and sisters. Good evening to you all, families and friends. Good evening, dear sister, sister Masa coming to you with this evening video, whatever you are. I just welcome you on this live video on YouTube. Just in going our generation, whatever you are. I just welcome you on this live video, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. Our God is good and kind and wonderful God. He's gracious, brothers and sisters. Good evening to the body of Christ. You are, you are hard to welcome, brothers and sisters, on the YouTube video, wherever you are. As you join your sister on the video, brothers and sisters, I would like for you to please share my videos. Leave a comment, brothers and sisters. You cannot just watch the video or you leave a comment. Like and share the videos to your brothers and your sisters and people that need to also listen to the word of God as you are in the light. People need to come to the light, brothers and sisters. I want to bless God for today. I want to thank God. Thank you for this platform. I pray that God. Those people that have subscribed, they're going to share my videos that other people also subscribe to this channel, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. But I come to you with the good news from the children of grace this evening, families and friends. Blessed be the name of the Lord. The name of the Lord is a strong tower, families and friends, for the righteous run to into, and they are saved. Brothers and sisters in the Lord, thank God for Jesus. Thank God for you this evening, whatever you are. I just welcome you on this live video, families and friends. I bring you the good news from the children of grace. From our King of Kings and Lord of Lords, Jehovah Nisi Eshada Elohim, Jehovah Shalom, Adonah, Yeshua Hamashiach, our Savior of the world, the King of the world that is coming, will soon be coming back, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. I will just. Unto the yoga, unto the yoga, to the left of my soul, unto the yoga. Unto the yoga, to the left of my soul, oh my God, oh my God, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed, no, no, let not my enemies try over me. Brothers and sisters, unto the O God, Psalm 25, do we lift up our soul unto him? Jehovah Nisi Eshada, unto him we live our soul. He is our God. Let him not put us to shame as we put our trust and our confidence in, in him, O God. He said, Those that trust in him shall be the man Zion, man Zion, that can never be removed by God forever. Psalm 125. And Psalm 25 says, Unto thee, O God, unto thee, unto you, O Jehovah Nisi Eshada, Elohim. Do I lift all our soul? I lift all every soul of every human being in this world unto you this evening, Papa. In this country, all the platform, people that are going to subscribe, even in the future, I lift up the soul of every human being, your people that are called by your name, O God, unto you this evening, O God. That Lord, you will not let our enemy, our enemies to trumpet over us, O God, but you will allow us to trumpet over them, O God. Hallelujah. Our enemies will be on our feet, O God. Papa God, I want to thank you. thank you for this live video. I want to thank you for the message that is coming unto your people. That Lord, you bless every heart, every soul. Father, to listen to your word, O oh God, and to be blessed when the word that is coming to, to them this evening from their sister. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. The first scripture reading, Father God, I want to you, thank you, Holy Spirit. You minister unto your people, even as I come with your word to them. God, you speak to their hearts, O oh Father. You minister unto them and bless their heart, O oh Father. I just want to tell you, thank you that bless your name for having your way this hour. Let your will be done in the, mat in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray. Amen. Amen. Let it the word of God be done, brothers and sisters. The first scripture we're going to be doing for you, brothers and sisters, is concerning the rapture. First, first Thessalonians 4, 15. First Thessalonians, first Thessalonians 4, 13. I'm going to read for you about the rapture, brothers and sisters. I'm going to read the scripture we're going to bring it to you this evening. I'm reading, I'm reading from first Thessalonians 4, from 13, about the rapture. Hallelujah. Everybody rapture, brothers and sisters. The rapture that's going to take place. We got to be on the alarm, brothers and sisters. We got to be awakened. Four from 13. Brothers and sisters, I'm reading from First Thessalonians chapter 4 from verse 13. But I who not I will have, I will, I have not, I will not have you in no, to be in no. Brothers and sisters, he's telling you an R. Paul is telling you an R, brothers and sisters, that he, he don't want for you and I to be ignorant. 
he know to be ignorant of the things that will come. He said concerning, he said brethren, he said concerning them which are as asleep. People are still sleeping in time like this. Brothers and sisters, whatsoever that have been said on the internet, whatsoever people, prophetess and prophets and ministers of the gospel, evangelists, apostles, they are telling people about the end time, about things that will occur. People are laughing. Just in the day of Noah, when God, Noah got the message to go and bury our brothers and sisters and tell people that the flow, God going to destroy the earth floor, people were mocking Noah and laughing at him. Brothers and sisters, but in, in our time, this is the scene where they come in. The Bible says the coming of the Lord be like the days of Noah. So we got to be very, very careful, brothers and sisters. When, when prophecy comes about anything in this world, you got to get yourself prepared. You got you to you pray, brothers and sisters, and seek the face of the Lord to be with you and your family when time comes so you can be on the emperor or on the wings of God Almighty, brothers and sisters. He said, he said, but... I will not have you to be in, no, brethren, concerning that which is, which I is asleep, but that yet sorrow not, even the others which have no hope. Brothers and sisters, he, they, they tell the evangelists, the, evangelist, the, the uh, uh, Paul, the apostles, they are telling you and I that we don't, they don't want us to be in, no, of these things. Uh, but the, 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 the signs and these things when they begin to happen, we should not be asleep. We should not be like other people that are sleeping that do not have hope. But we have hope in Christ Jesus, brothers and sisters. We are not sleeping. We are aware of everything that is going on. We need to pray. That all we need to do to pray and seek the face of the Lord in time like this, everything that is happening. We need to pray and seek the face of the Lord, brothers and sisters. That is why he's telling you and I that we are not like other people that don't have no hope. Hallelujah. 14 says, But if we believe that Jesus Christ died and rose again, even so, then also we sleep in we sleep in Jesus will God bring with them. Hallelujah. 15 say, For this is for this we say unto you by the word of the Lord that we which are alive and remain the same of the Lord. Brothers and sisters, the saying of the Lord said, We that are alive and remain before his second return, we that will be alive, brothers and sisters, and remain. He's telling us now, alive and remain unto the coming of the Lord shall not prevent them from which I are asleep, from those that are asleep. Hallelujah 16 says, For the word, the Lord himself, shall descend from heaven with a shout. The Lord Himself, Yeshua Hamashiach, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, He Himself will come, will come with a shout from heaven. The archangel will blow a trumpet with a loud voice, a loud sound of the trumpet of the, of the archangel, brothers and sisters. For the Lord Himself shall descend from heaven with a loud voice, with the what? With the archangel, hallelujah. And with the what? The trumpet of God, Jehovah, I just said to you, the trumpet of God and the dead. In Christ shall rise for us. I'm talking about the rapture, brothers and sisters. I'm talking about the rapture that going to take place, brothers and sisters. There will be a great falling away. The beast will come and sit in the temple of God and, and classify himself as God. That people will be on a strong delusion. Those that do not believe in God will go on a strong delusion to, be, be, to believe that Antichrist, that devil, that demon, that Lucifer will be in the temple that will classify himself and make himself as God. People will worship him, brothers and sisters. But let me tell you now, the children of God already know of this thing. We gotta pray without ceasing and be in the vineyard and in the tabernacle of God. Oh no, his confidence, brothers and sisters. Yes, this is the time. This is that time for you to be your know, one for is in the church, your one for is also. This is the time for you to wash yourself and put yourself in the in the in the church, your full armor. Put on the full armor of God, brothers and sisters. Ask God for forgiveness. Repent of your sin. Do not be playing with sin. There's not time to play with sin, brothers and sisters. Or what Christ will come and meet you into your sin. This is the time for also repent. Then he say, yeah. The Lord Himself will blow the trumpet. The archangel will blow the trumpet, brothers and sisters. The trumpet of God and the dead in Christ shall rise first. The dead in Christ shall rise first, brothers and sisters. When the rapture is taking place, the dead in Christ shall rise first. The Bible says, 
17 said, Then which we which are alive and remain shall cut up, shall be cut up together with them that are in the cloud to meet the Lord in the air. And we sh shall live, we shall be with him forevermore. 18 said, Wherefore comfort one another with these words. Hallelujah. Praise be to Yahweh. Wherefore we need to comfort one another in the faith. We need to encourage our brothers and our sisters in the faith. In time like this, brothers and sisters, we need to encourage one another, pray for one another, hold on one another, one another brothers and sisters. And pray and seek in the face of God, diligently and hacking unto the voice of the law, living according to the promises of God, walking in righteousness in the statutes of God, brothers and sisters. Hold on to God, unstinging hands, trust in the law with all your heart, serve the law with all your heart, mind, body, and soul. Do not lean on your own understanding, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. This is not a time for us to play church. This is the time for everyone to repent and cry to God every day for mercy. Because Jesus Christ's second return will be like a thief in the night. Nobody knows the hour, the minute, only the only God knows. The angel said does not know his second returning, brothers and sisters. The rapture, the, 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 the before the rapture take place, what I just read to you. Hallelujah. In the book of First Thessalonians 4, from 13 all the way to 18. Go and read it. You will know about the rapture. So you cannot be in no, in no ignorant about the devices of the enemy that will come and tell you a lot of lies. You can be aware of what's going to happen that day because the power does not lie. The word of God is powerful, brothers and sisters. Whatsoever the word of God has said concerning the end time, that what stand, nobody should come and fool you and give you a lot of lies and tell you this, this will happen, this will happen. No. Read the word of God for yourself and know the word of God and know what's going to happen to prepare yourself in time like this. Praise be to Yahweh. I will read for you First Corinthians. That also talking about the rapture. 15 from 50. From 50. First Corinthians is the second scripture reading. Brothers and sisters, families and friends this evening. May God richly bless you all as the word is coming forth to you this evening. Thank you, Jesus. Yeshua Hamashiach, we thank you. 1 Corinthians 15. I'm reading all the way from 50 down, brothers and sisters. From 50. 1 Corinthians 15. 1 Corinthians chapter 15 from 50, I read. Now, this I say, brethren, that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God. Neither do corruption inherit incorruption. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. Brothers and sisters, flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God. No. No flesh and blood can inherit the kingdom of God. You have to be, you cannot be alive and go to, in, in, you cannot be alive and go to heaven. You have to pass through death before you can go to heaven because there's no flesh and blood that will inherit the kingdom of God, the Bible says. No. Hallelujah. This is why everybody in the twinkling of an eye, everybody will get changed. That will be still be alive when Christ coming back to take away the church. Those that will be alive, brothers and sisters, and remain will change in the twinkling of an eye and change in a, another form before you can descend with Christ to go with him, brothers and sisters. Otherwise, you cannot go. Hallelujah. Thank God. There's no flesh and blood in heaven. No incorrupt or corrupt can inherit the, 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 the kingdom. 51 said, Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall be changed. Everybody will change, brothers and sisters. There will not be anyone that will be sleeping. Everybody will change. And 52 say, In a movement, in the shrinking of an eye. Hallelujah. He's telling us how we're going to change, brothers and sisters, to change to Christ, the way how Christ is. The how everybody will change in your tongue of an eye. How the thing change to another body, another form, brothers and sisters. In the tongue of an eye, at the last trumpet. For the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall rise, incorruptible, and we shall be changed. 53 say, For this corruptible must put the incorruptible, and this mortal. Must be immortal. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. This mortal body that we have had to be immortal. Brothers and sisters, to 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 to
crest in the air. Brothers and sisters, for us to cut off a crest in the, in the air, this mortal has to be immortal. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. 53 say, 54 say, so when this corruptible shall have put on the incorruptible, and this mortal shall have to put on the immortal, then shall be brought to pass. The saying that is written, death is what? Swelling up in victory. Thank you, Lord. Oh, death, where is that sting? Oh, grave, where is the victory? Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. The sting of death is sin, and the strength of sin is the law. But thanks be to God, which gave us victory through our world, Lord Jesus Christ. We will have victory through Christ Jesus that day, brothers and sisters, when, oh, when the sins go marching in and putting on the incorruptible because flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God. On that day, brothers and sisters, we all will gather color with him in the air, brothers and sisters. And if a chain of an album will change to the Im in the immortal, brothers and sisters, to meet him in the air and will be with the Lord forever and ever. Brothers and sisters, if only our name will be found written in the book of life, if only we will remain holding on to our faith and continue to trust God, working in a vineyard, continue to serve him, not serving other gods. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be ye steadfast, unmovable, always, abound in the work of the law. We should stay fast, hold on to your faith, do not change. Do not turn to the left, do not turn to the right, do not watch any other. Do not be deceived by the enemy. Do not worship any other God. Do not worship any statue. He said, be stiff, stay fast. Don't be movable. Always abound in the work of the law. Always remain in the work of the law, brothers and sisters. Let us always remain in the work of the law. We should not be deceived and be careful about deception. Let us stay fast in the law. Hold on to our God. On changing him. He is the author and finish of our faith. Hallelujah. Always abide in the work of the law in as much as ye that your labor not in vain in the law. We should hold fast before our labor be in vain as long as you change, brothers and sisters, and go on the broad way, brothers and sisters, your labor will be in vain. All you have labor for, all you have worked for in the vineyard of the law will go in vain. Because you got to hold fast unto the Lord, brothers and sisters. You got to hold fast and continue to trust your God. Hallelujah. John chapter 14, verse 3. Let me read John chapter 14, verse 3. It's the, the, the John chapter 14, verse 3. If we don't hold unto the Lord, brothers and sisters, all your effort will be in vain. And God forbid for your effort to be in vain. All the suffering. All the suffering you and I will go through the tribulation here. God forbid that everything will go in vain last minute of time. If you get switched and changed and you be deceived, you gotta hold on to God and you remain in your vein yeah, and hold fast onto Him. Brothers and sisters, families and friends, the body of Christ. John chapter 14, verse 3 say, And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself. That where I am, there you may be also. It's the, it's the coming of Christ as, as well. He promised that he's going to prepare a place for you and I. And when he go and prepare, and prepare that place for you and I, he's coming back again to receive us to where he will be. Where will he will be, this where he wants us to be as well. Brothers and sisters, and how can we be to where he's going to be? We're going to get ourselves prepared. We're going to hold fast unto the law. We're going to continue to trust the law. Unto thee, we, 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 we lift our soul unto him every day of our life. And let us put our trust in him. Because he will never let us to be ashamed. Psalm 25. Unto thee, O God. Unto thee, O God. Do not live all my soul. Hallelujah. Unto thee, O Adonai. Do not live all my soul. Oh my God. Oh my God. I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Let not my enemies trials over me let not our enemy trample over us brothers and sisters 
God Almighty, let not our enemies trample or let us put our trust in God and hold fast unto the Lord, the brothers and sisters, because when the rapture is taking place, hallelujah, the rapture is going to take place, brothers and sisters. Whether you like it or not, the word of God is final. Whatever he has said, that what's going to happen, you cannot change it. You cannot stop it. But yet, get yourself prepared. Be on the right trap. Be on the right side of God. Do not be on the wrong side, brothers and sisters. Do not go after material things. Do not go after the devil. Do not be deceived by his deception and his confusion and his delusion. Do not go. Do not fall for these things. Hold on to your goal. Keep your faith. Walk in the vineyard of God, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. Walk into the vineyard of God. Do not be deceived. Do not be kept away by the deception of the enemy or the lies of the enemy, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Because... The Bible says when we don't wash out, brothers and sisters, with everything that we do here, it will be in vain if we don't stay fast in the law. We will miss the trap. Yes. We will miss him, brothers and sisters. We got to be very wise and watchful. The Bible says watch and pray. First steps of the day, for someone to say pray without ceasing, families and friends. We need to pray without ceasing. Pray every day. Brothers and sisters, and watch and pray and see the sounds that is going on around you. Listen to what the prophet said. The prophecy of the prophet, the midst of the gospel, eventually, whatsoever they are talking about, people are dreaming dreams and explaining the dream. Brothers and sisters, do not overlook anything that God. Do not overlook anything that God has showing or revealed to his prophet or evangelists or apostles. Do not overlook it, brothers and sisters. Take everything at half. Walk according to the, 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 the word of God for your life, brothers and sisters. Walk into his vineyard. Be rest standing with your makeup. Jehovah Nisi El Shaddai. Be rest standing with him. He's the only one that can save us in this world. He is the only one, brothers and sisters, that can save you and I. No one else can save us in the world. Nobody beside God, through Christ Jesus our Lord. He said, for he is the way, the truth, and the life. John chapter 14, verse 6 says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man come unto the Father except by me. No man will come unto the Father except by Jesus Christ, the Messiah, Yeshua, Yeshua Hamashiach, the Savior of the world. He is the only true him. And anybody can be saved. Nobody can be saved. In any other name, there's no other name in the heaven and the earth that man can be saved through the sin beside the name of Jesus. Beside the name of Yeshua Hamashiach. Beside the name of Jesus, brothers and sisters. The name of Jesus never loses its power. It will never lose its power, brothers and sisters. I come to tell you the scripture reading today about the rapture. Just go and read the two scriptures. I will put it there in the reference, in the video, brothers and sisters. So you can look at the, 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 the scripture and read it for yourself to know what I'm talking about, brothers and sisters. The good news to the throne, from the throne of grace is even... Our God is merciful, He is gracious, He is powerful, He is the everlasting King of Kings and Lord of Lords. He's the beginning, He's the end, He shall His glory, no man. His word is the word that will stand forever, even as the heaven and the earth will pass away. I bring the good news to you this evening, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. That we should stay fast and hold on to our God. We should not give in to the enemy. We should hold fast on our God. He's the author and finisher of our faith. He's the beginning, He's the end. He's the one that made way out of nowhere. He's our defender. He's our rock. He's our refuge. Brothers and sisters. He's our strength. He's our defender. He's our healer. He's our provider. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. He's our refuge. He's our everything. Brothers and sisters. You cannot do nothing without the presence of God in this world. Hallelujah. Praise be to Yahweh. I just glorify his name. This evening, brothers and sisters. Whatever you are. Father, in the name of Yeshua Hamashiach, Holy Ghost, I just commit your people into your hands this evening on this video, on this YouTube video. I pray, oh God, for your people that will come across my video. I pray, oh God, that Lord, they will subscribe to this channel. They will like and share my videos, oh God. Let the word go forth to the people that need to listen to your word, oh God. That the life will be transformed. That the life will never be the same, Papa. You are the only one that can save this world. Through the blood of Jesus Christ, every man can be saved. No one can be saved. There's no Palestine can be forgiven by God blood or sheep or cow blood. But only the blood of Jesus can save. Come and friends. We all have to come to repentance. We need to ask God for forgiveness. Our shortcoming, our wrongdoings, that God will wash us with the blood of Jesus to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Come and friends. Praise be to Yahweh this evening as you join me on this video. May God bless you. May God keep you. 
for an, until another live video. May God bless your family. God bless your children. God bless your, your grandchildren. Your entire generation. May God bless you as you watch this video. Brothers and sisters, may come across my video. May God bless your home and bless your heart as you watch this video. That your life will never be the same, brothers and sisters. The Holy Ghost will transform you through hearing the word of God. Faith come by hearing and hearing the word of God, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Romans 10, Romans 10, 17 says, But faith come by hearing and hearing the word of God. This is how you build all your faith by hearing the word of God all the time of your life. You listen to the word of God. You read the word of God. You listen to the word of God. It build all your faith. It build all your courage, brothers and sisters, in the law. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Jehovah Nisi Eshada. Papa God, I just bless you. I just honor your name this evening for your word. Bless your people unto another live video. May God make a face to shine upon you, families and friends. Let him be gracious unto you and give you peace that surpasses all understanding now and forevermore. Peace I live with you, families and friends. Shalom. Stay blessed.